meet the Nigerian woman richer than Wizkid, Davido, Dangote, and Burna Boy combined. <laughs> Hello there! When it comes to sourcing for a hot topic and highly engaging entertainment just in Nigeria, you can always count on us. Thank you once again for subscribing, and if you haven't, please go subscribe and hit the notification bell to keep you updated on the latest gist. While it is clear that David O, Wizkid, and Burna Boy are three of the richest musicians in Africa, did you know there is a renowned woman who may be richer than the four combined? Well, maybe not. But that is true. Now, the question is, who is this woman? How old is she? Where is she from? And how did she make her wealth? Her name is Ehi Ogbebor. She is the CEO of Saiveth Interiors and Hotels. For those who didn't know, Saiveth Interiors is probably the biggest and most luxurious interior designing firm in Nigeria. The company has only been in existence for less than nine years now and Ogbabor has since managed to become a self-made millionaire. While the woman being discussed is no doubt very affluent, I think it is ridiculous to say that this woman has more money than Dangote and all these other heavyweight men. That's more than a reach, it's a stretch. But that aside, let's do some background check on the self-made millionaire. Ehi Zogi Ogbabor was born on 15th June 1985 in Benin City, Edo State, which means she's 35 years old. At the age of six, Ehi, as she is fondly called, attended an end-of-year cultural dance at the Palace of Oba of Benin, where the Oba walked up to her with a couple of chiefs and declared that her head was meant for a crown. Over the years, that prophecy came to pass, as we will soon discover in this video. The Edo-born businesswoman grew up in Benin, where she completed her primary and secondary school education and obtains her first school leaving certificate and her West Africa Senior School Certificate, respectively. After she completed her primary and secondary school education, she proceeded to Ambrose Ali University at Poma, where she graduated with a BSc degree in microbiology. Ehizogi Ogbebor is a highly intelligent and skilled businesswoman. She is the founder and CEO of Sayaveth Interiors and Hotels, one of Nigeria's biggest luxury interior designing companies. She is popularly known for the business prowess she possesses, having left an insurance job to invest in a business predominated by males. She now runs one of the biggest interior companies in Nigeria. She started small, with basic house finishing after graduating as a microbiologist from AAU, after which she became a marketer for insurance and expanded to furnishing and luxury. Since then, Ehi Ogbabor has been best described as a business Amazon that stands out as one of the most popular in Nigeria. She recently completed her million dollar mansion, which she celebrated during her 35th birthday. While she didn't start building her business pyramid today, she was a marketer for an insurance company for eight years before she took the big leap into the interiors and decoration business. Her marketing insurance job fetched her a car worth eight million even when her bosses were using official cars. However, she channeled her skill set into business and secured her first contract in 2011, which was to fix a curtain for a client in Emo State. It didn't yield much profit, but she learned from that experience. Before she started her brand, Sayaveth, she was still brokering business and was into a joint venture, which she later untethered from, following advice from her bank account manager. Saiveth, according to her, is a name she coined from a cartoon TV show. She has undergone numerous courses in wall finishing and designing to perfect her skills. And today, Ogbebor is the CEO of Saiveth Interiors, one of Nigeria's biggest luxury interior designing firms. The Big Break Ogbebor's Big Break came when she landed a job to furnish a 4,000-meter square building owned by an undisclosed Nigerian senator. She added a hotel to her profile to support her interior decoration business. Her hotel served as another source of income, but mainly as a demo and accommodation for clients who came to see her previous furnishing works. She expanded into the hospitality industry in 2016 with Saibeth Hotels in Lagos. Ehi Ogbebor is currently single, 
but was once married to billionaire Ken Braymore as the fourth wife. The couple called it off just after eight months. Here's what happened. Ehi Ogbabor tied the knot at a very tender age with a man with which she had two children. However, the marriage came to an end and 10 years after, she got married to another man named Kenneth Braymore, a Wari-based billionaire and oil magnate. A full load of controversy surrounds Ehi's marriage to Kenneth Braymore. Their expensive and lavish wedding was attended by prominent men and women of De La Creme in Nigeria, including Senator Dino Melaye. The couple gave out two exotic cars as a souvenir during the wedding held in Edo State and anchored by Efosa aka Sir Flex. Well, Ehi's ex-husband is a Wari-based billionaire and oil magnate, so he could afford such. Their union was blessed with a girl child. Ibuere, and a boy child, Kenneth. However, the marriage got terminated eight months after marrying billionaire Ken Braymore. Ehi Oglebor terminates the union, describing her marriage as a curse and spewing grave scandals about Ken. She described him as a cultist and serial husband during an interview she had with Stella Dimoko. According to Ehi, Ken is presently engaged to another lady by the name Shirley whom she said he was dating before he got married to her. She also claimed her ex-husband tried to kill her child, Ibuere, but failed. She went further to accuse the billionaire of getting engaged to other women, up to six of them, with whom he has up to 10 children. On his part, Ken said he divorced Ehi on the grounds of infidelity. Ehi Ogbebor moved on with her career to become one of the richest women to compete with Wizkid, Davido, Dangote and Burner Boy Wealth, and here is why. When Ehi left Kenneth, she didn't leave shedding tears. Even if tears were shed, there were enough Naira and dollar bills in her hands to dry those tears. In addition to the money she got from that marriage, Ehi also runs a thriving interior and hospitality firm named Sayabeth Interiors and Hotels. She completed the building of a wildly expensive over $1 million mansion which she debuted and celebrated during her 35th birthday. According to sources, the multi-million dollar construction began in December 2018 and got completed in May 2020. The ultra-modern, multi-million Naira seven-bedroom home features an abundance of gold accents in its interior design. The gold is combined majorly with white and some black. Besides the seven bedrooms, the mansion comes complete with state-of-the-art fixtures, including an automatic toilet seat, a grand piano, an indoor viewing room, and a full-size swimming pool. As an interior design expert who's also into home construction services, this majestic edifice is the best advertisement Ehizogi could have done for her business brand, Saeveth Interiors and Hotel. Ehi's net worth is not yet verified, but it should be about $500,000. She owns a very expensive mansion and runs the affairs of a top interior and decoration company that extends their services outside Nigeria. Now, back to the question. Is she richer than Davido, Wizkid, and Dangote? Contrary to what the video going around says, I do not think so. Yes, she has attained crazy money from her failed marriages and multi-million dollar businesses, so much that she may be richer than the likes of David O. Wizkid and Burna Boy. But Aliko Dangote is still very much the richest person, not only in Nigeria, but in Africa also. Until today, many people still speculate about the source of her money because they feel her business will not allow her such a life of luxury. However, amidst all the speculations and wondering which is which, one thing is clear. Ehi is enjoying her life at a high class level. And that's it for today's gist. If you enjoyed this video, comment down below your thoughts. Give this a like, share with your friends, and don't forget to hit the subscribe button and notification bell to keep you updated for more latest celebrity news from Nigel Gist.